nobody wants their logo being wiped away. What do you think this, 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 and this have in common? All of these required painstaking consideration, attention, energy, and detail from their packaging designers. We'll labor over what side of this box has the directional font and includes all of the things that need to be included. Packaging designers have to worry about things like seam lines, color bleeding, where the ingredient list goes. Consider the life cycle of a product. Very expensive deodorant I bought. Mm -hmm. The formula of the deodorant doesn't work with the formula of the ink. And nobody wants their logo being wiped away. You want your packaging to evoke joy. You want it to be indicative of what your product is going to bring them. It's not only protecting your product in transit, it's also representing your brand. Something like this has to be engineered. These have to pass drop tests. Drop it from certain heights to make sure that the packaging holds up, that these nail polishes aren't falling out and cracking. You don't know who's handling your product. If getting on a boat somewhere, off of a port somewhere else, getting on a truck somewhere and finally to the warehouse where somebody's unpacking it and then it has to get into the box to ship to your customer. Packaging is the first line of defense. We have lots of packaging designers on the freelance portion of our sourcing marketplace who would love to help you out and make sure that your product is protected and looks great when it arrives at your customer's doorstep.